Hello, welcome back to my channel. Today I'll teach you woven cross stitch, also known as cross stitch flower and interwoven cross stitch. This stitch looks fantastic with a bead like hole in the middle of the stitch. It looks like little flowers in a vine. We'll work this stitch in two parallel lines and I have marked dots in half centimeter gaps. Insert the needle in the bottom line and take it out. On the top line make a cross stitch like this. And pull over you will get a cross stitch. And now again in the bottom line straight to the previous stitch you insert the needle and take it out through the starting point now you will be getting a cross stitch normal cross stitch like this and once again insert the needle on the top line in the same points like this and pull over the thread will automatically come above the previous stitch and now insert the needle through one thread so that one thread will be above the needle and the next thread will be below the needle and finish the stitch in the bottom line like this you can have a look at your woven cross stitch it will be so cute with threads woven one above the other and a bead like hole in the middle and long holes on the four sides once again i'll teach you start in the bottom line make a cross stitch and then again in the bottom line make a stitch once again in the same points in the top line and again insert the needle through one thread and bring it to the bottom and finish it i hope you are clear about the stitch now i have already posted 150 hand embroidering stitches and i have given all the links in the description if you have missed my previous videos go to the links in the description and learn about the embroidering stitches if you like this video share with your friends and relations please click the like button and if you have any doubts please comment in the comment section if you have not subscribed for my channel please subscribe also click the bell icon so that you will get notifications for my future videos you can make these cross stitches in borders and also fill your patterns with these stitches in large areas and for small flowers in your designs and now i have finished the stitches and i'll show you the back view of the stitch it will look like small stitches on the top line and like back stitches on the bottom line and for filling the patterns you can put cross stitches in between like this in the next line I will finish this pattern and show you. See, this is how it will look. And I hope you are clear about this woven cross stitch now. I will meet you again with the next stitch. Thank you for watching.